Hey guys, before I get into the video, I want you to pay attention to the gameplay. I'm actually getting the gameplay at the moment. I want you to look... I, pay, just pay attention to it. Because sometimes you might just want pay to pay attention to the voice. Because that's obviously the good stuff. But just to pay attention to how good Comcast is. This is how good my internet is. Bravo, Comcast. That w I just want to applaud broadcast. I mean Comcast because they are obviously the best internet provider in the world. And then, and then they're talking in game chat, and they're like, oh, "You freaking noob! You freaking noob!" All right, well, guys, enjoy the video. Peace. How's it going, my little ratchet spuddy here? Bringing you another video. They were doing the UMG Dallas pool play predictions video. Ooh, whoa! Very excited for this. Uh, UMG Dallas starts on Friday. I, I don't know. It probably starts around 3 p.m. I don't, I don't know, where's Dallas? I think that's Central, so, Central. Yeah, like 3 p.m. Central, something like that. I'm not even sure. Let's get right into this. Pool A, as you can see, Optic Gaming, Team Envy, XGN, and Duncan No Donuts, and the Open Bracket Team. I'm not gonna say anything about the Open Brackets Team, because obviously I don't know any of the Open Bracket Teams. Um, you know, the only Open Bracket Team that I really know is uh, DT, and I don't even know if they're gonna qualify for the any of the pools, so we'll see, but I'm just gonna leave out the bracket teams for now and yeah we'll see how it goes but these are my predictions let's get right into this pool a i have opti gaming and tim team envy going to the winner's bracket and then xg and duncan no donuts and the open bracket team going to the loser's bracket opti gaming dominant team uh you know it's scum crim6 formal and karma they are they're on a four win streak and they're just dominating this game. Honestly, number one team in the game for sure. They have most pro points in the in the whole entire game. They they're just their team is cred incredible. I'm I, I love that team. I really do. Formal Scump, Crim Six, and Karma. Great team. Great players. Everyone's great on that team. They're, let's see if they can get the five peat. And then you have Team Envy. I really like this team too. You know, Team Envy just got a new roster. They added Octane, Aqua and jcap put including looney to that squad so that's gonna be a really dominant squad as eh, too there i like that team too and then i have opti gaming and team envy qualifying for the winner's bracket let's go ahead into pool b phase clan rise nation enigma six rod squad and rod squad i mean uh you know great great team there's all a bunch of these teams i'm not even sure who rod squad is i've never even heard of them literally never even heard of them they probably played like 2Ks and 5Ks. Um, I think Nelson's on that squad, actually. Um, I think that's really all I know about them. I really don't know anything about them, so I can't really judge them too much. Uh, but I have to, I'm going to have to go with my gut here. I'm going to say FaZe Clan and E6. Rise Station, I really don't like I, I don't like Rise. I really don't. I just don't like Rise, man. They just added TCM. I do like TCM. He's a great player. But they also, well, they also add TJ and TCM. I really... You know, they're good, they're young, young guns, you know, da -da -da -da, young, 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 da -da -da -da. young, you know, but, uh, Chino, Wheats, TCM, and TJ, I just, I don't know, I don't, I don't like the squad, I really don't, I like TCM and TJ, don't like Chino and Wheats, it's just like 50-50 right there, Chino's, I can not even try to be mean, Chino's, <laughs> Wheats is, <laughs> and then TCM's pretty good, and TJ's pretty good too, you know, TJ's done. And I have uh, E6 is Parasite and Ruiz, um, General and Proofy. They just add proof. I love this squad. I really do. I really like it a lot. You know, I would probably say they're the best like AM team. I mean, I don't know if you'd call them pro or whatnot because they're not in the pro league. But uh, we can just say them. We can just say they're pro. Uh, they're the best pro team that isn't in the pro league at the moment. Uh, great team. I wish they would have bought a league spot. Maybe, you know, bought TCMs or something. That's what everyone thought was going to happen, but that ended up not happening. But uh, I have FaZe and E6 going to the winner's bracket for Pool B. Let's go ahead and head into Pool C. Uh, we have Denial Esports, Team Caliber, VVV Gaming, and Isolation Esports. I, I actually like C Pool C and D. They're pools of death. Like, they are literally filled with knives and freaking M16s and just Simtex and stuff. And C4, uh, freaking Molten Tar, Lava, I don't even know, Maltovs. Like, Pool C and D is crazy. Pools of death. I can't even say anything about the pools. They're crazy. They are literally... Uh, they are psychopaths. The, the pool, pool D is definitely the pool of death, but so is Pool C. Trust me. Pool C is crazy too. 
but like I said, Denial, TK, BVV Gaming, and ISO, um, you know, it's definitely the pool of death. Um, but I have Denial and TK coming out of this. You know, some people would say Denial, ISO, but I say Denial, TK, because I like TK, I like Nezlo, I like Theory, I like Nameless, I like Sharp. And then Denial Esports, you know, obviously, they're just like, they're a pretty good team. You know, it's full of Slayers. You have Slasher, Temp, Puke, and Replays. Replay is not really the main guy to go and slay. He's definitely an in-game leader because he is the captain of that team. But, um, you know, I, um, Denial is a little inconsistent, but I do, I like the team. I like the team. Hugh and Temp, I just, I just love Hugh and Temp, honestly. I like how they just, they have great chemistry because, I don't know, it's just so weird. I, I watch them play Money 8s and just, I've seen them scrim and league matches and they just, they mesh so well together. Like, freaking sponge dude you, you have like the wool part like the uh what do you call it like the little wool part and then you have a sponge sponge part and it's just like they mesh so well man it's like oil and water wait actually i th don't do water oil even i don't i don't know forget about that but like i said i have to die on tk going to the winner's bracket and then beat i don't have hope for vv gaming it's felony bizerp john and fears i believe don't take my word on that, but I think that is the team. Uh, I don't have hope for them. Fizz, Fizzer just hasn't had the game of his life in AW. He really hasn't. He was pretty good in Ghost. He was really good at S&D in Ghost. But um, heading into Pool D, the Pool of Death. Ah, brrr, boom, boom. Pool D is crazy, guys. Crazy. You have Team Elevate, Optic Nation, TCM, and Epsilon. You know, all, all four of these teams. All four of the teams are in the league. And, oh man, this is just crazy pool. I have Elevate and Optic Nation coming out of this pool. I think Optic Nation's going to win this pool and Elevate's going to come second in the pool. Optic Nation, they improved so much. If you saw them at the Season 3 Relegation Tournament, they placed fourth. And they, they look good, but they didn't look that good. But I've just seen them scrim. They look so good. They are just looking like a great team now. Moach, Miracles, Embos, and Ricky. I love Mochilla. I just want to lick his beard. I want to. I just want to eat those breadcrumbs out of his beard. I love Mochilla. He's my favorite pro. If you guys don't know that yet, but I love Mochilla. Embos, Ricky, and Miracles. They're pretty good too. But Mochilla, great AR. He is just. He's a solid player. He really is. And then you have the Elevate team. You have Saints, App, Slack, and Classic. Um, I don't. I like the team, but then I don't at the same time. I don't like how they're all subs. I don't know, I just don't, like, when I say Elevate, I don't think of Apathy and Saints on Elevate. I think of Slack, Classic, TJ, and Temp. That's what I really think of. But, uh, you know, I just, I don't really like the Elevate team that much, but I do have them coming second in the pool. And then you have TCM Gaming, Epsilon, TC, TCM Gaming. They just, uh, I don't like it. I don't, I don't like it, guys. I really don't. I don't like it. I don't, I, I don't like it. Uh, it's Aches, TP, Moose, and Jerd. Um, Ace and TP just haven't had the game of their life, just like Vizzer, and then Moose and Jerd, they're, you know, they just haven't had the game of their life. I don't like TCM, alright? Don't judge me about it. And you have Epsilon, just going off by how, they do, how they're doing the league with these other three league teams, I'm just gonna say they're gonna come in dead last in this pool. They're 0-4 in the league, 0-4 or 0-5 in the league right now, so we're just gonna say they, they're coming in dead friggin' last in the league right now. But let's go ahead and to my top three for this tournament. UMG Dallas top three right here. I have OptiGaming winning the whole thing. I have Team Envy coming second. And then I have FaZe Clan coming in third. Those are my top three. OG, Envy, FaZe. Those are my top three right there. I definitely think those are solid teams. Some people would wonder, why don't you have Denial? Why don't you have Denial? Because like I said earlier when I was saying the pools, they're inconsistent. You have to have Slasher going off, you have to have Hute going off, you have to have Temp going off. You have to have you have to have all four of the players going off for them to play well. They're going to get outslayed. Uh, their chemistry, it might be there, it might not. You know, I don't know. I haven't really seen them play that much, but I have seen them play a good bit. But, you know, um, I just don't, I don't have hope for Denial. I really don't. I like the team. I personally really like the team a lot. But uh, I don't know. We'll see how they do. But like I said, OG Envy phase. Those are my top three right there. And I hope you guys enjoyed this. Really, I hope you guys enjoyed the UMG Dallas predictions video. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe, follow on social media. Links will be in the description below. It's been Jalen, guys. Peace.